in class 12 the p block elements we will start group 18 elements and in this video we will discuss about occurrence atomic physical chemical properties and usage of group 18 elements first of all what are the elements involved in group 18 you can see from this table these elements are helium he neon any argon ar krypton kr genon xe radon R and again sun this is OG and these are their atomic numbers okay and you can easily correlate these atomic numbers if you add plus 8 then we will get this one if you go from this to this again you add plus 8 again if this to this you can add 18 and from this to this again you can add 18 and if you go from this to this you can add 32 and from this to this again you can add 32 actually these number 8 8 18 18 32 these are magic numbers okay and all these are gases and chemically unreactive they form very few compounds because of this they are termed as noble gases Occurrence. All these gases except radon and organson occur in atmosphere. Their atmospheric abundance in the dry air is about 1% by volume of which argon is the major constituent. Helium and neon are found in minerals of a radioactive origin, for example, pitchblende, monazite, clavate. The main commercial source of helium is natural gas. Genon and radon are the rarest elements of the group. Radon is obtained as a decay product of radium-226. You can see this is the nuclear reaction. It is radium-226 when emit alpha particle. This is the helium is this alpha particle. Then this will convert into the radon. Organson has been synthetically produced by collision of californium-249 atoms and calcium ions. Okay, so you can see this is the reaction. This when these two are collide, they produce this organson. Its half-life is only 0.7 milliseconds and its electronic configuration is radon 5F14-6D10-7S27P6. Atomic properties of group 18 elements. Electronic configuration. The general outermost shell electronic configuration is NS2NP6 except helium. Helium has 1s2 you can see from this table helium is 1s2 neon is 2s2 2p6 argon is 3s2 3p6 krypton is 4s2 4p6 genon is 5s2 5p6 and radon is 6s2 6p6 atomic radii increases down the group with increase in atomic number as the number of cells increases ionization enthalpy Due to stable electronic configuration, these gases exhibit very high ionization enthalpy. However, it decreases down the group with increase in atomic size. Electron gain enthalpy. Since noble gases have stable electronic configurations, they have no tendency to accept the electron and therefore have large positive values of electron gain enthalpy. Physical properties. All the noble gases are monoatomic. They will not combine. Only in atomic state they exist. They are colorless, odorless and tasteless. They are spongily soluble in water. They have very low melting and boiling point because the only type of interatomic interaction in these elements is weak dispersion forces. Helium has the lowest boiling point, 4.2 Kelvin, of any known substance. Helium has an unusual property of diffusing through most commonly used laboratory materials such as rubber, glass or plastics. Actually, helium is indeed a very small that can leak out of not only rubber balloons but also through metal 
कंटेनर्स केमिकल प्रॉपर्टीज ऑफ प्रोपेटिन एलिमेंट्स इन जनरल नोबल गैसेस आर लीस्ट रिएक्टिव बिकॉज द नोबल गैसेस एक्सेप्ट हीलियम हैव कंप्लीटली फील्ड एनएस2 एंड पी6 एनएस2 एंड पी6 इलेक्ट्रॉनिक कॉन्फिगरेशन इन देयर वैलेंसी सेल they have high ionization enthalpy and more positive electron gain enthalpy in march 1962 neil bartlett synthesized the first compound of xenon first he prepared a red compound which is formulated as o2 ptf6 he then realized that the first ionization enthalpy of a molecular oxygen remember that is molecular oxygen o2 that is 1175 kJ per mole was almost identical with that of oxygen that is 1170 kJ per mole that's why he made another red color compound xenon that is xcptf6 by mixing ptf6 and xenon this is the basis actually the formation of compound of oxygen with ptf6 that is o2 with ptf6 is the basis for the formation of compound of xenon okay first he prepared this then he analyzed that ionization enthalpy of o2 and xenon is almost same that's why he synthesized the compound of xenon also the compounds of krypton are very fewer only the difluoride that is krf2 has been studied in detail compounds of radon have not been isolated but only identified for example r and f2 by radio tracer technique no true compounds of argon neon or helium are yet no xenon compounds are mainly with most electronegative elements like fluorine and oxygen this again you have to note down it is because of the most electronegative nature of fluorine and oxygen xenon can form compound with them usage of noble gases first we'll discuss about use of helium helium is non inflammable and light gas hence it is used in filling balloons for meteorological observations it is also used in gas cooled nuclear reactors liquid helium boiling point is 4.2 kelvin finds use as a cryogenic cryogenic means very low temperature agent for carrying out various experiments at low temperatures it is used to produce and sustain powerful superconducting magnets which form an essential part of modern nmr spectrometers Okay, and MR spectrometers and magnetic resonance imaging MRI. I think you are familiar with this term. This is used for the medical purpose. MRI systems for clinical diagnosis. Okay, and NMR and MR is nuclear magnetic resonance. Okay, it is used as a diluent for oxygen. in modern diving apparatus because of its very low solubility in blood neon is used in discharge tubes and fluorescent bulbs for advertisement display purposes neon bulbs are used in botanical gardens and in greenhouses argon is used mainly to provide an inert atmosphere in high temperature metallurgical process that is arc welding of metals or alloys and for filling electric bulbs it is also used in the laboratory for handling substances that are air sensitive xenon and krypton they are used in light bulbs designed for special purposes okay student thank you